Hi, this is Amrita Sarkar. I am from India, working for Solidarity and Action Against the HIV Infection in India. We are working in 19 states and basically on HIV AIDS and for the key populations. And uh, globally, I am also representing IRGT, that's a global network of trans women and also we work on HIV. I am not a PrEP user currently because there are so many reasons in our country, I mean in our country it's not easily accessible and those who, who, who can want to buy through the website only, this costs lots of money as well and there should be doctor's prescription all these things so if I need in, in near future I'll be following the medical process and that's very much important. There is some issues actually, issues in terms of like uh, trans women uh, they are very much vulnerable towards HIV and STI. Yes, I know STI has not to do anything with PrEP, but HIV is a major concern in our community. And uh, because of the poverty, because of other issues, they sometimes, you know, involved in sex work. And most of the time, uh, they are not uh, like, uh, can, uh, you know, do their own uh, or use their own uh, confidence to get on PrEP or uh, any kind of a prevention like condom because if the client wants and if she is paid more money then she has to go for it so and uh, most of the time uh, we have seen in my community if clients wants more pleasure i'm talking about india then they are not supposed to use condom because there's a like wrong notion in client's mind that yes if i'm not using condom then uh, i will get more play pleasure but we know that's absolutely wrong so it's very much important for the trans community to you know our themselves our, about PrEP and how PrEP can help in terms of you know to prevent the HIV. Globally, there are certain countries where PrEP has been accessed by my community. I'm talking mainly about trans women. That I know that in Thailand it is very much accessible and the government is also helping for that and also in some Latin America country in the USA. But rest of the world, I think it's not very much easily accessible or available. And most important thing is that using PrEP. Uh, is good okay fine but to know more ab about preps that is more important i mean why i should use prep and how, what are the medical recommendation to follow prep or to take prep that is more important see the main uh, problem is sometimes you want to start any works and any activity without any evidence or without any data so i think a mapping is very much important in uh, like all across the globe where prep uh, study has not been done among the community regarding the accessibility and how they can access it and from where they can access it and where if there is any support available for that then we have to you know assess the community preparedness to take prep